Hillary Clinton has said in the past that she will release her transcripts to the speeches she gave on Wall Street if everyone on the else in the race does it. Well, Seth Abramson with another great point in a blog he wrote for Huffington Post. Now everyone has. Uh oh, spaghettios. So, uh, in the past, you had Ted Cruz, Marco Rubio, John Kasich, all these people. Uh, John Kasich not only had speeches on Wall Street, he worked on Wall Street. He w was with Lehman. Uh, so, that was deeply problematic for him, but they were all out of the race. So, the only two people left in the race are Bernie Sanders and Donald Trump, who haven't given any speeches on Wall Street. So, according to her own standard, she should now release all of her transcripts. Now, of course, she won't. The reason is she made about $12 million in speaking fees to just financial industry groups uh, in the recent past. That's a lot of money. She didn't go over there and yell at them. That's not what they pay her for. In fact, she gave three speeches to Goldman Sachs, all at $225,000 a piece. If Goldman Sachs didn't like the first speech, they wouldn't have given her the money for the second or the third. Apparently, she told them exactly what they wanted to hear. That's why she doesn't want you to see the speeches. But I didn't make up the standard. In fact, I objected to the standard. Hillary Clinton is the one who came up with the standard. If everyone in the race releases their transcripts of speeches to Wall Street, she will do likewise. Well, now we have met that standard, and it is inarguable. So I'm looking forward to reading Hillary Clinton's speeches that she gave to Wall Street. I mean, she doesn't have anything to hide, right? And she didn't lie about that standard, did she? Let's find out.